Hi you guys, it's Rich from Teach Me Music Academy and today I'm going to be talking to you about understanding tab. So tab, or tablature as it's also called, is a really common form of music notation that guitarists and bassists use to read music. It's much more simpler than using music score and it's really, really simple to get your head around and I'm here to explain that to you today. So if you were looking at tablature, you'd see it as six different lines and each of those lines corresponds with a string on your guitar. You always read tab the same way. The lowest line will represent your low E string and your highest line will represent the high E string. And all the lines in between represent the strings in between. Makes perfect sense when you think about it. When you're reading tab, you'll read it exactly like you would with a book. You'll start on the left hand side and you'll work your way to the right hand side. You'll see along the way notes written next to each other. When you see notes written like this, it means that those notes to be played one after another. If you see notes all written at the same time, it means they're all played at the same time. Once again, dead easy to get your head around. Rather than using music notation to write the notes on the fretboard, we use numbers. It's a really simple system to get your head around. Each number on the string denotes where you'd put your fingers on the fretboard. So if you had a two written on the fourth line of your tablature, you'd look at it as if you're looking at your guitar like this, with the low string to the high string, and we'd go one, two, three, four. So we'd be playing on our G string, and the second fret would be there. So as we said before, we read tab going along from left to right. As we see notes written, we play them. So if we saw the notes zero, one, two, written on the lowest line, we'd play this. On the other hand, if we saw all the notes written at the same time going down the lines, so if we had a zero on the low line, a two on the next line up, another two on the next line, a one on the next line, and then two zeros on the two highest lines, we'd be playing a chord and we'd play it as we're reading across all at the same time, just like this. It's a really simple and basic system to get your head around, but it is the cornerstone for a lot of guitarists when they're trying to learn songs. There are numerous sources online you can get tabs from and almost any song is available written in tab format. Obviously a lot of people upload to the internet, so some of them might contain mistakes, so it's good to use your ears to have a listen to the song that you're playing in order to pick up any differences in the tab that you might find. However, for the best part, it's a wonderful way to learn songs. And once you get your head around it, you'll find it really easy to use. Unfortunately with tab, there's no way to denote rhythm, so you'll often find it written in conjunction with musical score. We'll cover that in another lesson, but for the time being, have a little look at tab when you've got the chance, have a little look at it, see if you can play something simple, just like this. And that's all for this lesson, we'll see you in the next video.